In this video, we will show you how to install your new Riven Lee drying rack. First, let's go over the different parts that you have in your box. You have one large divided tray. This will be the top tray, your sponges tray. You also have one mini tray, which will fit into the top tray. There are also two large trays with a step at the back and a rubber band at the front. These will be the mid and the bottom trays. In your box, you also have three different pairs of legs, which are marked with the letters A, B, and C. The A legs are the bottom legs. The B legs are the middle legs. And the C legs are the top legs. The only difference between legs B and C is that the C legs have this small pin inside of them. You will also find a small mini leg, which you can add for extra stability. Okay, now let's get into it. To get started, we will use the A legs and one of the trays with the rubber band. First, place the tray on a flat surface facing downwards. To make sure that you insert the legs in the right direction, pay attention to this thin end cap sticking out right here. This bar will slide into this narrow guide that you see here on the tray. Grab one leg and hold it by the side which has the arrow mark on it. To insert the leg easily, press the four legs side panels inwards and easily slide the leg into the hole all the way through. Repeat this step with the other leg. At this point, you should also insert the mini leg into its proper place here if you wish to add extra stability to your rack. To insert this part, simply squeeze its two legs together and place them in the tray like this. Now turn the tray over. Now let's move on to the middle tray. Grab the other tray that has a rubber band and both legs that are marked with the letter B. Slide the legs into the tray in the same way that you did with the first tray. Now it's time to connect the trays together. To do so, simply insert the B legs into the side leg holes of the lower tray all the way through, like this. Do the same process with the top tray and the C legs. See how these legs have this small little plus shaped pin inside? This shaped pin will go into this round hole, which you will find at the bottom of the top tray. Again, pay attention to the thin bar, which will show you the correct direction to insert the legs. Flip the tray now and slide the legs into the side holes of the middle tray, just as you did before. Make sure that the Rivan Lee logo on the top tray is facing towards you, the same side as the rubber bands. To finish, place the mini pink tray in the middle of the top tray. By the way, if you only have a small amount of brushes to wash, you can use just two trays by connecting the top tray, the one with the sea legs, directly to the bottom tray. You are all done. Now go and wash your brushes.